All right, here we go. Question 24 from our Calculus 1, homework number 4 in WebAssign. It says, if f of 4 equals 3 and f prime of 4 equals 3 fourths, they want us to use the formula, the derivative of the inverse of f equals 1 over the composition f prime of the inverse of f of x to find f inverse prime of 3. And so we're going to go to our notes and show you how to crank this out. So what I've done is I've recopied the problem here in my one note, stating that f of 4 equals 3, and the derivative of the function evaluated at 4 is 3 fourths. So this formula is what we're going to be plugging and playing into in order to calculate what they want me to find. Okay, so the first thing I notice here is that x is 3. And so I'm going to come over here to this formula, and I'm going to replace every x with 3. Done. Now then, we're going to use this fact right here that f of 4 is 3, and what we know about inverses to figure out what to plug in for. So if f of 4 is 3, then the 4 would be the domain of f, and the 3 would be the range of f. For an inverse function, the domain of the original is the range of the inverse, and the range of the original is the domain of the inverse. Therefore, we can conclude that f inverse of 3 would be 4. And what that does, that allows us to now substitute for this piece right here. That's going to be 1 over the derivative of f evaluated at 4. And then coming back up, we know what that is. f prime of 4 is 3 fourths. And so there we can plug and play again, giving me 1 over 3 fourths. And then if I do a little KCF, a little keep change flip, we're going to get our answer to be 4 thirds. And now all we need to do is plug that into WebAssign and verify and getting the green check of success verifies that what I taught you is correct. And that's going to do it for this particular problem. If you have any questions or comments about anything covered in this video, please feel free to post it in the comments below, or you can text me. And thanks for watching.